You're very welcome to Newsboy on Track for Saturday the 26th of January. After the seemingly endless and very British talk about the weather, it's finally Festival Trials Day at Cheltenham. We've got eight races and 90 runners, all of them interesting in their own way. None more so, though, than Imperial Commander, the 2010 Gold Cup winner returning from injury, or the new one, the unbeaten novice hurdler. Nigel Twiston Davies is the trainer of both horses. He very kindly took time out to talk us through their progress. Nigel, we haven't seen the Imperial Commander since Cheltenham in March 2011. What's been keeping him off track? He disappointed in the Gold Cup because he broke a blood vessel at the top of the hill. Uh, anyway, he left here, went to Northern Ireland where he goes through summer holidays. And then as though getting him ready to come back, he had a bit of damage to one of his tendons on his front legs. Um, so he then came, you know, so he then had to have a year off. Came back here in September, and he was already to run in the Betfair Chase when we schooled him, and he just knocked a, a splint bone, which is a bony growth, which isn't a great problem, but it just caused pain, so he, that put him off for six weeks, um, and that he's been fine ever since, so we're ready to go for Saturday. You see footballers um, pulling Achilles tendons sort of thing, you know, it's the same sort of thing, it's just a horse that's so much bigger, it takes longer to mend than it would a footballer. And all being well after Saturday? Another crack of the Gold Cup. There's no reason why he shouldn't be as good as he was before, but only time will tell. He was better than Denman and, 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 and uh, as good as Corto Star. You know, he was only beaten a nostril at Haydock by him, so you know, if he comes back to anything like that form, he, he's got to have a good chance in any race. Now, the new one is unbeaten over hurdles. I'm presuming you rate him pretty highly. At this stage of his career, he's as good as anything we've had. You know, he's... Uh, had six runs, only been beaten once, and had an unlucky run in the festival bumper. Otherwise, he's he's won every race he's been in really quite easily, so he's looking pretty good. And he looked very impressive at grade two level at Warwick two weeks ago. He certainly did. I don't think he beat them much that day, but uh, you know you can't do any more than win. It was so easy for him at Warwick, he probably does more at home, so we thought it wouldn't do him any harm, just have another run. That was Nigel Twiston Davies, trainer of Imperial Commander and the new one. Both of them likely to take centre stage on Festival Trials Day at Cheltenham. We'll have reaction to the whole card next week. Join us then.